everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel Ray and today I have something really special to share with you. This is a box, a subscription box from the Black Needle Society. You probably heard about me talking about them on Floss Tube, where I talk about cross stitching and if you haven't seen that before but you're interested in cross stitch or needlework, definitely check out their website. I am a VIP for their or a rep, sorry, for their company so if you want to um, check out the links that I have below. That would be awesome, but I do encourage you to check them out. Um, these boxes, it takes a long time for them to curate these, and I think that you're going to like what's inside. So without further ado, let's go ahead and open it up. Let's see what we have inside. I have managed to avoid spoilers all this time, uh, and so, yeah, ta-da! All right, so here we have... This is, oh, look at that picture. That's such a cool picture. Happy hour stitching with two martini stitcher. Okay, I don't want to look too closely because there are spoilers. Uh, and you can look if you like, but it says that this was, uh, this is steampunk. So I'm not going to look at it. <laughs> I'm not going to look at it right now because I want to see what else is in the box. So we've got a bunch of this protective cardboard confetti which can be composted and then we've got all these goodies oh my goodness look at all these beautiful goodies all right let's see what we've got in here all right I'm gonna start with the thread jewelry so this is a basically a ring a floss ring that has a beautiful dirigible actually it's a dirigible with a ship can you see the ship part? That's beautiful. This reminds me of the movie Kiki's Delivery Service. That is gorgeous. So basically you can just put your specialty flosses on this ring. Let's let's see what specialty flosses came in the box. And then I can show you how that works. So here is our specialty floss box. Ow, 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 ow. Finger got stuck. <laughs> trying to bite me. Did you see that? <laughs> it's almond M&Ms. Oh my goodness. All right. Oh, I'm losing them. Okay. So these are from almond M&Ms and these are little silk nuggets. She likes to make things very small. You should check out her floss tube actually. This is called Nautilus. Actually, hold on. What's wrong with my phone? Here we go. So this one, this one is called Nautilus. We have Hugo. Next is, uh-oh, these two got mixed up. One of these is Gears and Sherlock. I'm going to say that that must be Gears and this must be Sherlock. Let's put those back on. <laughs> so you can see here the two colors. Get my camera to focus for you. There we go. This beautiful rust color and these purples. So pretty. So, so pretty. Really like that. And so you can take these and you can put them onto floss cards and then attach them to the thread jewel or the, sorry, what's that called again? <laughs> thread jewelry. Here's some floss cards, actually. Speaking of floss cards, look at this beautiful picture. This lady in a top hat with an air balloon. All of these things kind of remind us of Victorian era and also steampunk, which is really cool. So you can use these to attach those flosses to. You just put one of these rings onto this ring, and then the other ring you loop your thread through which is really neat. Then it looks like we have a needle minder. So this is an exclusive needle minder. Now this box, just so that we, you know, uh, this box is sold out. It's, it's over and done with. But if you see something in this box that you like, you can probably find it in the vault, the Black Needle Society vault. Oh, wow. This needle minder says the League of Extraordinary Stitchers. That's really cool. I like that a lot. 
nice big magnet on the back too. Then we have a very helpful tool. This is a fabric measurer. So you can see through this piece of uh, plastic here, and you can see how many holes per inch your fabric has. That is really, really helpful actually. Very cool, I've been looking for one of those and now I have one, thank you so much. What else do we have here? Oh, a notebook set, very neat. So I haven't looked at the book yet, so I'm not sure, but we have one that says contrivances <laughs> and one that says inventions. Oh wow, and it's a bullet style, very neat. I love notebooks. Oh, this one's a grid. <gasps> you could make your own patterns. That's what this is for. You can you can sketch out your oh, oh my gosh, I'm definitely going to be using this. How cool is that? And then this one you can use as a journal. They're really nice paper as well. They're heavy duty paper. Very cool. I like that a lot. <laughs> I know a lot of people will be happy about those. That what's this? Oh, how cool! It's a laser cut wheel organizer from U Gears. So it's gonna look like this. It's a little ship's. Uh, what do you call those? What are those called? Navigational jobbies. <laughs> how cool is that? Oh, that'll be really fun to put together. You know, I bet I bet my husband would really like to do this because he's really into puzzles and stuff. Thank you for that. That is really cool. That is going to look excellent on my desk. Ooh. Then we have a piece of fabric. Crinkle, crinkle. Watch your ears. So this is called Gunmetal by Be Stitch Me. This is a 32 count linen. And it's an eighth. It's beautiful. It's a little bit on the bluish, greenish gray side. But that is stunning. I wonder, I wonder what our stitch, what the what the pattern's gonna be. If this if this is the fabric, what is the pattern? <gasps> I'm super excited now. Alright, <laughs> let's let's see if it'll tell us. So just going to make it look all nice and tidy here because we're probably going to use those. I'm guessing. I'm guessing. I have no idea. But, all right, let's see. What's this? Ooh, this is a project bag. Oh, cute. It says the Black Needle Society presents Steam Stitcher. If you can dream it, you can, you can stream it. You can steam it, stream it. I have streaming on the brain. <laughs> That's cool. Look at the, the flosses here and the needle. Oh, that's adorable. It's nice to have little project bags for those smaller stitches. Neat. And then, oh, ooh, look at this. All right, we can move the box now. This is Superior Bees. Professor Hiveman's and Professor Hiveman's clockwork pollinations. That is beautiful. I love those long straight lines, the beehive. So it does not use these flosses, but oh, how pretty. You could change the colors if you like. Take flight into your imagination where things in the garden are not quite what they seem. How pretty. There are French knots and some back stitch as well. Three colors, antique black, creme de la creme, and lacquered gold. Very pretty. Oh my gosh. <gasps> I love it. That's so pretty. What do you think? Let's go back and look over here at this, at this and see what it says. So there's a heart needle minder that was designed by the Black Needle Society. 
Specialty Floss made by Almond M&M's. It says, these gorgeous silks were dyed exclusively for our March subscribers. It reminds us of the gorgeous silk gowns of the Victorian era. And then we have the floss card set. Inventors are notoriously disorganized. Use this thread card set to keep your threads from getting lost among your tools. This is Louise Derolt artwork. Dirigible thread jewelry. Uh, designed by the Black Needle Society. Very cool. This is inspired by Katie and Laura's favorite steampunk book series, The Finishing School Series by Gail Carriger. I haven't heard of that yet. Clockwork Wheel Organizer. Add some steampunk to your stitching area. The wheel organizer is meant to hold pens and pencils, but we're going to be using it to store our stitching scissors. Good idea. Maybe highlighters, too. <laughs> The gunmetal fabric. Gunmetal is a special material used to make clockwork gears and machine parts. What a perfect inspiration uh, for your next cross stitch project. You could use this for this project, but it doesn't actually go. This isn't the called for fabric. The called for is simply Sage by Fabrics by Stephanie. The fabric measurement card, which got hidden underneath the fabric. Uh, this is the typography is by heritage type it says and uh yeah it just says this can line up the holes of the fabric it's really helpful inventors notebook duo um i've already explained it it basically just says the same exact thing then we have the steam stitcher accessory pouch um <laughs> This is so neat. I love it. So this, they say this is for your accessories. And then the, the cross stitch pattern by Summerhouse Stitchworks. We asked Beth to design this month's pattern after coming across her postcard series with similar steampunk vibes. We think she outdid herself. It's so pretty. You can use beads instead of French knots if you're not a fan of the French knot. Now... It says here that there is an availability of the Retreat in a Box for July. If you would like to join, this is a specialty box that's open to everyone. You do not have to be a monthly subscriber to get in on that box. So definitely check out the link that's down below if you're interested in getting a Retreat in a Box. Then they have this um, photo challenge, which today, as I'm filming, is the 6th. So I'll try, I'll try my best to take a picture and put it up today. Um, but if you participated in the photo challenge on Instagram, you could be entered to win a $25 Etsy gift card. And here are some pictures from before. Very cool. Thank you so much to Katie and Laura at the Black Needle Society and Athena too, for putting together these boxes and bringing us some really fun accessories in these boxes. I do enjoy receiving them and sharing them with everyone. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them down below. I highly recommend that you join their newsletter if you want to get more information about when the waitlist will open up, etc, etc. But thank you so much for hanging out and watching this video and seeing all these beautiful goodies with me. I hope that you're having a wonderful day, a wonderful week, and I will see you all very soon in my next video. Take care, everyone. Bye.